their remarkable efforts have been bolstered through a grant from the Hughes Electorate Stronger Communities Program, which enabled the acquisition of a hotbox, a mobile food heater. This means that the RRT can now provide more meals for our first responders in emergency and crisis situations. I give the call to the member for Hughes. Thank you, Deputy Speaker. Today I'm delighted to speak about the contributions of the Rapid Relief Team, an organisation largely run by volunteers that provides catering and support to our first responders during emergencies and crisis situations right across Australia. I particularly mention the Engadine team, which is located within my electorate of Hughes. I recently joined the R RRT's COO, Nick Dunn, and many volunteers at Holsworthy Army Barracks to acknowledge and honour both women and men of the New South Wales Police, New South Wales Ambulance and Fire and Rescue. While our first responders played netball and touch football, highlighting the importance of physical health to sound mental health, I saw firsthand the work of the RRT's catering expertise. Deputy Speaker, their remarkable efforts have been bolstered through a grant from the Hughes Electorate Stronger Communities Program, which enabled the acquisition of a hotbox, a mobile food heater. This means that the RRT can now provide more meals for our first responders in emergency and crisis situations, whether this be in bushfire areas, in floods or in other situations. The volunteers cooked me a delicious hamburger from ingredients kept warm and safe in that hot box. Deputy Speaker, I applaud the RRT for being a pillar of support, not just in Hughes but across Australia. Their tireless efforts, whether through distribution of warm meals or fostering resilience and care, elevate our emergency services. Thank you to the Rapid Relief Team and particularly all of those at the Engadine Team.